Okay, so let's let's do the unboxing right now. So, ladies and gentlemen, this is what you're going to receive um, when this DT4261 comes to you. All right, so let me share with you. Uh, if you look at the box over here, all right, you can see um, three years, three years warranty. All right, three years warranty made in Japan. All right, made in Japan. Okay, and it's IP54 graded. And it's drop proof, all right? It's drop proof, one meter drop proof. Okay, and there's many other features uh, which uh, Eugene has mentioned, quick response, various graph display, but you need to use with the um, Z3210, okay? All right, there's many, many features over here. And um, okay, also, uh, so uh, you will be able to see what's inside this box, all right? So you can see that, um, uh, the bundle accessories include the new test pro, test test pro L9300, all right, and included the batteries, all right, three batteries over here, and uh, optional items like I mentioned earlier, optional items um are the okay, if you can see, optional items meaning is not included in this uh, package, uh the wireless adapter. So um I mentioned earlier this Z3210 is not bundled in this. DT4261, but, okay, but if you purchase um, now all the way to 29 October within this period, all right, this Z3210 is free, all right, it's complimentary, it's complimentary, all right, so you can actually scan the QR code here to, to, to purchase the, uh, uh, to purchase, to, to make a pre-order now, okay, to make a pre-order now. If you're still not convinced, let me open it up so that you'll be convinced. Okay, then um, also other, other optional items, you did mention about the communication package. Um, what else? The other uh, uh, pin set, alligator clip set, that you can see, you see? Okay, over here. Okay, and also the magnetic strap. The magnetic strap is very good, you know, because um, if you want to, um, I think just now in the video, you probably already see that um, if you want to hands-free and if you need the magnetic strap um, to, to actually to hang the multimeter, uh, while you're doing your measurements, you need this magnetic strap. So just to share with you, Z5020, Z5020 is a heavy duty one. So it can actually withstand very, very high, uh, heavy, heavy weight. Okay, so Z5020, so, it, it, so uh, it is it's suitable to even carry our, to use for our power quality analyzers. So you know power quality analyzer is always, it's already so big, right? So if it can actually withstand the weight of the, Power quality analyzers, it can also withstand the weight of the DT4261. Uh, okay, so I'm going to unbox now. Uh, okay, so another, another thing, if you need a carrying case, uh, all right, it's also not included. All right, this is optional item as well. If you want to find out more about the prices of these optional items, you can look for our distributors. Uh, some of them have already purchased from uh, our Philippine distributors. You can check with them all these um, optional items. All right, okay. So let me unbox it right now, okay. Okay. <laughs> okay, so what you're going to receive here. Okay, so let's see. Can you see? Okay, maybe I'll put this, put it like put it like this. Okay, so once you take out, this is how it looks like. This is the DMM. All right, this is the DT4261. Let me put it down. Okay, so this is the DT4261. Uh yeah. Okay, so apart from the model, the unit, all right, you will also be able to get this um, L9300 Pro and the batteries are inclusive. Okay, so this is, uh, remember what Eugene mentioned about the, okay, so this probe, uh, what's so special about it? It's also the first probe that Hiyoki has um, developed. You don't need any cap, you know. So some of the end, uh, uh, end users, um, you know, they, they feed back to us, uh, they always lose the cap. All right, uh, during measurement. So because of their feedback, our engineers have heard you. Okay, so what they have actually done is that um, you can actually just unlock, slack it back and push it forward. And uh, you will not, you will be able to do the measurements easily. Uh, not, not to worry about losing the caps again. Okay, so this is a new probe from Kiyoki. So this probe is already included in the um, package. Okay, and with these uh, three batteries over here. Okay. Also, um, there will be a, okay, so in case you are worried how to use the function, if, no, now if you are worried, worried about how to use the DD4261, the video that we have shown earlier is on our YouTube, you can search for Hyoki Singapore on our YouTube page, you'll be able to find out how to use the DD4261. Otherwise, all right, you have a very, you see this, 
this uh, this instruction manual very colorful, very easy to read. Let me share with you. Our engineers have you know um, a number of Hiroki manuals has won the um, Japan Manual Award. Uh, DT four two six. I'm not too sure, but I believe maybe in future because this is quite a new product. So just to share with you, uh, even our memory high logger LRA four five zero have actually won the um, Hiroki manual award so we take pride you know in in what we do not just our product itself not just our product but even all the way drill drilling down to our manuals they are very easy to read um so that to give you see the font are also very big you know some people can't see right yeah so so the font are even easier to read um than 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 uh, other other brands manuals all right so if you want to find out more about how to use the uh, uh, dt4261 you can find it, everything over here how to use the um, z3210 all right to do the simple harmonic analysis how to use the z3210 to do excel extract function it's all available in this small but handy manual right it's all here all right okay so it's very clearly written all right okay let me see yeah yeah okay and uh, we also have another one is the operating operating instruction is also inside. So if um, just in case, um, just in case if you are worried that you did not purchase the Jengvin product, I believe, I believe um, uh, there wouldn't be any fake products going on. But just in case, all right, just in case, if you are worried, just make sure that all these are available inside. Okay, so let me repeat myself. This is the digital multimeter. All right, the DT4261. Okay, and you get the L3900 Pro, the new Pro, and also the batteries is included. So you don't have to purchase batteries at all, right? They are included. And uh, if you remember what Eugene mentioned, the batteries can be easily, you, know, can, you, don't, have, you don't need to need any screws anymore, you know? So uh, what our engineers have actually improved, this is a, a, a improvement and a feedback from the uh, young engineers. You know, you can actually use your fingers or use your coin. Can you see? All right. So over here, you don't need a screwdriver anymore. You just need to use a coin or screwdriver to unscrew it and you can open up uh, this, this casing. All right. Yeah. So you can, you can, maybe I should do it. Huh? Do we have a coin here? Do we have a coin? <laughs> can we get a coin over so that I can show people how, how easy it is? Okay, now let's get a coin so that we can show you how easy it is, it is to open this. Okay, so you don't need to use screwdriver anymore. You can fit in the batteries easily. Okay. Okay. So, and you can see that it's actually very easy. You can, you can grip it easily in one hand. Uh, we have improved the design already. Uh, in fact, also another thing, do you realize that the... Hey, thank you so much. Okay, let's take this. I think 20 cents is good enough. So, um, if you realize that... Um, uh, the 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 rotate rotary switch uh, is already it's actually flush with the uh oh, I think my webcam is oh 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 wait 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 okay it's a bit sensitive okay good okay can so sorry yeah all right so just to let you know this is live uh, really live this is not pre recorded that's why my webcam was was there was there was some issue so sorry about that okay i think it, it should be better now so ladies and gentlemen i was i was sharing this uh this 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 rotary switch is actually flush with the uh, multimeter so in fact uh it was actually another improvement in the design if you actually place it on the uh, flat surface it doesn't it doesn't it doesn't actually have a jerky jerky movement so um if you compare to the other uh, multimeters that we have, this rotary switch is actually protruding out. Like. So this one, all right, this DT4261 has been improved so much so that this rotary switch is actually flush with the surface and is easily grabbed with one hand. Okay, all right, it's, it's slimmer, all right, and it's, easier, uh, it's easy to hold with one hand. Okay, let's open up with this. So uh, other multimeters is actually have to, you have to open up with a screw, but this one you can actually open it up with the with the coin okay wait see okay so i'm going to show you how, how you open it okay over here turn okay okay is it correct no wait let's see yeah okay hang on this is the first time that i've experienced this huh? because i just got this product only Ah, okay. 
See? Got it. Okay. Oh, sorry, the other side also. <laughs> okay. Turn. Okay. So you have to make sure that. Ta da! Okay. So that's it. You see? So it's so easy. You just need a coin to unscrew, and this is out. So easy. You don't need any screwdrivers at all. Okay. And yet at the same time, it's drop proof and it's IP54. Easy to use, but yet all the safety, uh, all the all the uh, safety uh, features are well protected as well. All right, it's very rough, it's very durable. All right, so don't 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 say it like this. All right, it's very durable and rough as well. Okay, so you can put in your batteries easily over here. Okay, let's put in. Okay, let me put in for you. Okay, let's do a full demo for everyone. Okay, so that I just hope that after this um, Facebook Live. Do you think we will be able to get another 10 or 10 orders? <laughs> okay. Okay, let's put in so the, I have the batteries here. Okay. Let's do it now. How many people are still online? About 35 only. Eh? Okay. Can we get more people? Please like and share, like and share. Okay. So let me put in the batteries. Maybe the rest of them went to purchase DT4261 already. <laughs> Okay, so okay, let's put it back. Okay. Let's put it back. Okay, square back. Square back. Okay, just to make sure it's secure. And then it's working. Okay. I mean now there's no 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 readings lah because I didn't plug in the probes yet. Yeah, so just to share with you it's, it's working now. So you can see there's a backlight function. I don't think you can see now because it's, it's pretty bright over at my side. So the backlight function is 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 a very is a very good function, especially for engineers who are you know sometimes in um, in compact spaces it's very dark you can't see the the readings. Can you see? Oh no, okay, it's a bit bright over here. Okay, I think you can see now. Okay, so you see? Huh? Okay, let's go. Ah, can you see? All right. So the backlight function allows our end users to see the readings easily. Okay, great. Okay, and perhaps ah, perhaps I can show you the the, the open fuse function. Okay, let's try. Uh, let me take out the fuse. Okay. Okay. Some of you might might not be too sure how does the the the, the fuse look, right? So let me show you how. Okay, so let me take out the fuse now. Okay. Can Jesse, can you help me take out the fuse? Because I'm not wearing any glove, lah. So I'm just, just in case someone send this video to, <laughs> I need to get some, my, my help. Okay, let me get, uh, let me get some of some of the help from my colleagues here to remove the fuse. So what I'm trying to do here is that I'm going to show you the, um, the 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 fuse the what do you call that the, the the red light function that will be triggered when the fuse is not there, the open fuse function. So uh, right now I'm actually getting one of my colleagues to remove the fuse for me because I'm not wearing any glove. So in order to, to play safe, all right, we in Hioki, we, we want to ensure that um, everything is safe. Okay, thank you so much. Okay. So now the fuse is, just to share, share the fuse is being removed already. Okay, no more fuse, huh? Okay, no more fuse, huh? Then I put it back, okay, put it back. Okay, let's turn it back again. So it's so easy, it's so easy, just a coin only. Okay. So you see? So let's can you see? Can you see a no, can you see fuse open? Actually it's a red light if you can see. Okay, let's try one more time. Just a reflection, huh? Okay. Okay. Okay, ready? See? Okay, so because the fuse is the fuse is not there. So because of this, right? So the digital multimeter actually there's a red light. I can't really you can't really see it here because it's very bright over at my side. So just to share with you, on top of the fuse open text, there will be a red light being triggered, so that it protects you if the fuse is open and you want to measure any kind of current, you will not be able to do so. Okay, so this is one a uh, uh, very good function of DT4261 to protect our end users if the fuse is faulty. Right, right now, I removed the fuse, lah, but if the fuse is faulty, it's not working, it will actually indicate the fuse is open and of course, you need to replace with a new fuse. Okay? I hope I explained myself clear. 
Okay. Great. Okay, I saw Alfie say great. Okay, so I hope that this was clear for you. If you want to know more functions about this, uh, uh, I think we I would like to bring Eugene back online. Uh, let's let's have a let's have an open um, discussion. Uh, I'm done with the uh, DT four two six one unboxing. Any advice? Here? Josephine, and uh, I've seen question. Uh, Josephine, asked, any advice if country <laughs> if country like Myanmar where no using money? Oh, okay. Uh, you can use finger also, I think. Okay, let's try. Eh? My finger is not that long, lah. Okay, so uh, Josephine, I, you can use you can use finger or coin or keys. Do you have a key? Do you have a key? <laughs> you take from my bag. There's a key. Oh, okay. Let's try. <laughs> my intern has a suggestion. Okay, let's use a keychain. Okay, very simple. No coins. Okay. I don't know. I've never tried this before. Let's try. Okay, let's try whether we can use this. Okay, so I have a key. Uh. Okay, so my, my colleagues have a lot of suggestions. No, no coins, never mind. Okay, let's try with the key. Uh, let's try with this, uh, huh? since this is a free gift being given. Okay, let's try. Uh. Okay, you cannot. Uh. This one is too thick. Okay, test and proven cannot. Okay, must use a thin one. Use the key. Can eh? Okay, so Josephine, let's, that answers you. This is a normal key. Any keys you put inside. Okay, you turn. Ta-da! Okay, wait. Okay, turn. Okay. You take out. You see? Josephine, does that answer your question? You donate a coin. <laughs> you donate a coin, okay? So you can use any instruments, uh, key, as long as it fits inside this hole. Uh, okay? Key is okay. Key is okay. Okay, tested and proven. Eh? Okay, so you can be creative. Anything, uh, not only coins. Um, any other things that can fit into this? Uh, get. It's not very small. Okay, it's not very small. A typical key will be able for you to, to, to turn it. So easy. You know why not? Because uh, sometimes you go to you go to site, right? How do you expect engineer to carry a screwdriver with them at, at all times? It's, it's impossible. So you know, for for guys, we um, to be honest with you, lah, we don't we don't put wallet into our into our 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 pockets. But somehow in for all guys, our pockets are full with coins, with keys, car keys, you know, all, all inside our pockets. For some reason, wallet is just not there. I don't know why, okay? This is just a, a typical man, okay? So um, for, for engineers, right, you can actually uh, just, you know, simply just put inside your hand and take, take out any coins, keys, you can actually uh, unscrew it. But of course, for ladies, you can also, la, you know, uh, coins from your pouch or also keys also can. So what I'm trying to say here is, ladies and gentlemen, all right, you don't need to use screwdrivers anymore. All right, who will actually bring screwdriver on site sometimes? I mean, uh, with you, lah. I mean, there are some people who actually bring, but majority of them don't bring screwdrivers on site, right? So you can actually use keys, use coins uh, to actually to unscrew it. That's right, Josephine said, uh, versatile multimeter, versatile multimeter. That's right, okay. <laughs> okay, so if you want to get this multimeters, please place your order now. Please place your order now.